welcome back everyone. As you know, we're on holiday in the Lake District for Katie's birthday. Because mm -hmm. she's 30 and also we're celebrating becoming parents. Oh dear. As you know, it's a miracle baby because of we were told we couldn't have kids. So we're going for a hill walk now because exercising is really important when you're pregnant. So this is Katie's first hill walk. Yes. But I have an excuse that we don't have to go too far, do I? No, unfortunately. <laughs> unfortunately, we can't go too far. I don't mean unfortunately the baby, because it's a miracle. So this is where we're staying. The lodge is at Artel Garth. Garth. I think that's right. And if you've been watching our videos, you would have seen in an earlier video, we did a tour of the log cabin we're staying at. And this is just a quick view of the surrounding area, look, all the hills. So we are going to walk around there and down the side up the hills, which we've been recommended by the guy who works here. And you have your walking stick. Yeah, I have my walking stick, my walking new t-shirt that we got this afternoon from the mountain. What's it called? Mad about Mount, mountain. Yeah, I mad about mountain, which I highly recommend. They were very helpful to us. I've also got. The head strap for the GoPro so we can record the walk for you guys. So this means the wifey needs to have the hat on. Um. I think it looks a lot better on the wifey than me. <laughs> so we'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Right guys, we're going to start our walk now. I've got Strava set so let's record it. Outdoor walk. So there we go in, I'm recording it. There's the wifey. Uh, and I'm sure. Baby. <laughs> I'm sure it's gonna be a boy. Yeah. We didn't ask to know the sex, did we? No, we want it to be a surprise. I've just got that feeling though that it's gonna be a boy. As I was saying earlier, when you're pregnant, it's you can still exercise and it's so important to get out and walk for you and the baby's health. So I thought I'd take Katie on the first outdoor hill walk. At five months pregnant. Five months and two weeks. Oh yeah, I can't forget the two weeks. 21 weeks today. Definitely think we're going to come back here, don't we? Oh yeah, definitely. We want to bring baby here when baby's made an appearance. Because yeah. this is the holiday we find out just... Just before. Yeah. We, we, well, we had this planned, coming here planned, didn't we? For Months, oh. yeah. Months. Yeah, do you know, I can't even remember when we... Booked it. Yeah. Baby brain. <laughs> ba pregnancy brain. <laughs> so as you can see, there's quite a few different lodges on this site. They sleep up to six and there's a hot tub. But as, as you've seen in the previous video with the tour, Katie can't go in it because the doctors have told us no. Because you can't regulate your body temperature when you're pregnant, so it's not good for the baby. I personally can't regulate my body temperature because of my head injury. That part of my brain doesn't work and I go hot and cold all the time. Yeah. But I suppose it's different when you're pregnant because you're carrying a baby in there. But you're kind enough not to go in it either, are you? Yeah. <laughs> I can't go in it because I'd feel I'd feel so bad that Katie can't. <laughs> Even though your mum and dad have said it's all right going it, Adam and Katie can sit on the side. And there's our lodge where we're staying. Oh yeah, over there with the towels on the on the fence around the deck where the hot tub is. So the people that work here have told us to follow this wall and then we'll come to the end 
and then it'll be signposted where we can walk and this is also how we get back into the village if we want to walk to the village which is which village are we next to Katie? Uh, Kirkby Stevens. Is that, yeah. No no the Kirkby Stevens is the main one what's oh. the other one that we have to drive through with the nurseries and the two pubs? Uh, Ravenstone Dale. Yeah that's it Ravenstone Dale. Oh look at the bridges lot over the stream I used to rock climb when I was younger and I've always loved the outdoors so it's, it's something I want to get back into I used to love going up to Derbyshire and stuff walking the hills and that and camping outdoors and that so I'm introducing it to Katie now and I want our kid to be able to do that instead of sat behind a computer all day That's good then. Oh, oh. Look, we're joined by sheepies. Yes, as we're driving up to the lodge, it's a single road and the sheep and cow just walk out in front of you. Mm. It is a track coming up to the side, isn't it? Yeah, because it's in the middle of nowhere, isn't it? Yeah. Which is really good and really peaceful so and quiet. Peaceful. Good thing you're being pregnant. I go at your pace. Yeah, yeah, true. You're not running off ahead. I mean, trying to keep up with you with my bad leg. I must admit, the, this walking stick's helping a lot better. I used to have one when I was younger, and I used to. I went to Lake District when I, well, I think I was 25, but I lost it, and we got another one before we came, didn't we? I just want to get the other one now, so I've got matching two, because you're meant to use two at the same time. Yeah, I certainly think two would be better. Yeah. Oh, look at that lovely stream lot that feeds into the front of the site. Oh, a little bridge. Ooh. I apologise for burp on uh, the so video. I it's only a natural babe, better out than in. Well, I know, because I have an app on my phone now. Yeah. They're saying that when you hit like 21 weeks, you start to feel like more bloated. And Just show them the app, because it shows you how big baby is, doesn't it? Yeah, so... So that is the size of babe... Oh. That is the size of baby right now. That's scary, isn't it? Yeah, and we have 133 days to go. We still can't get our heads right and that you've been pregnant for just over five months, can we? No, and I didn't know, well, I didn't know anything, but because of obviously the, the inject injections that I was on from to lower my blood sugars, I was physically feeling sick and I was sick, but, but we just put it down to the injections. <laughs> Yeah, because that that's one of the side effects, isn't it? Yeah. Hello, friends. Raven would love it here, wouldn't he? Oh, yeah. At Border Collie, that is. <laughs> I'm sure you've seen him in many videos before. If you follow us on YouTube. Also, going back to baby, that is the size of our baby's foot right now. Wow. This app is really good because it, excuse me, because it like, when you get to certain like weeks, it tells you like what baby does. All right. So like now I'm 21 weeks. This may sound gross, but apparently baby wheezes in your uterus and then drinks it. Oh. Oh look, there's another cottage there, look. Oh. That you can rent out. Green barn cottages. Ah. So the walkway symbol is this way, so... Can we go that way? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's the way, yeah. Because that must go into the... Um, the other 
cartridges that you can rent out. So we're just going to go up through this farmer's field. But we got probably right away because there's a, there's a sign for an arrow to say we're allowed this way. Where is the arrow? On that fence. Oh, I didn't see it. Baby brain. Yeah. Must make sure we shut the gate behind us. Yeah, it was only like that, so I just, just always leave gates shut. I'm just going to have to take your hat off for a minute. Okay. The smell is horrible. Yeah, it's all the uh, sheep poo and that. There look, there's walking signs look. Public bridal way and public footpath. Which way? Public footpath is that way. Is it? Public bridal way, so it's this way I think. Just have a look again. Yeah, so it's straight ahead, or there's one that way. Yeah, because the arrow that's pointing that way is the bridle path that we've just come down. Oh. Just keep walking. Oh, and there's the lake that the guy told us about a lot. And there's the village lot that we have to try for Ravensdale, that's it. Guessing if you want to go up the hills, you go that way. Just see where we get to. Yeah. Uh, there's my baby boy's friends over there. Yeah. Lumus. <laughs> yes, Raven, our, our dog, loves cows for some strange reason. He's got a stuffed cow at home as well, hasn't he? I bought him it when he was when he had his um, operation when he was poorly. Ah. Oh. I'm sorry if I sound out of breath. You okay? Yeah, I'm just a bit slower now. I'm just gonna walk on this bit. Okay. Good idea. I'll come and join you. Yeah. Maybe not. Yeah. Well, we had rain last night, didn't we? Yeah. Yes, I think I need to get some new walking boots because I've got a Ooh. hole in them. Just cross over here, Katie. So there's a stream there, look. That's it.
Let me just walk through this first, see if it's safe to walk through. It's a bit soft, but if you just walk quickly. Yes, as I was saying earlier guys, if you're pregnant, get out as much as you can for exercise. Just take it nice and slow and get your own pace. Get out for plenty of walks. Because it'll be good for you and, and baby. You okay? Yeah, a bit out of breath. Can't blame you carrying another human inside you. So quiet, isn't it? Very. So peaceful. Katie's chief photographer. It's the only thing I'm good at. Oh, you're good at lots of things, Katie. Yeah, for carrying your child. Our child. <laughs> yeah. You keep referring to it as my child. <laughs> Yours oh. as well. Okay, our child. <laughs> Takes two to make a baby. Oh, really? <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I think I'll be buying some new walking boots when, when we get back to Newark. If you're wondering what's on my back guys, I've got our mini tripod on my back because on the way back we want to get a selfie, don't we Katie, with all this in the background. Yeah. I think it's this way, look there's a footpath where people have been walking. You okay? Yeah. Oh, there's a little, little bit of a stream again here. Let's be careful. If you go down that bit there a lot, so there's no mud there. Yep, yeah, let me hold your hand, soft hands. That's okay. If you step across these stones a lot, so you're not washed with the mud. Idea was it to come here? It was yours. You you booked it oh, on the hill walk. <laughs> oh, we've got to get out and exercise, baby. Now, now we know baby's here. Ooh. 
Sorry if I squeeze your hand really tight. Oh, I've got it at you, Simon, so. Yep. You okay? Yeah. Thanks. Thanks for all the comments everyone's been putting online about our post, about having a baby. It's been in inspirational, the, all the amount of comments we've had. I think we're up to 98 comments and 100 likes. Is that right, Katie? The last time we looked, but there's probably like more now. So yeah. Yeah, we do so. We let all the important people know first, didn't we, before I put it on online. All the family yeah. members. Yeah. Which everyone is excited for us though. Yep. Because nobody thought that it was going to happen, did they? No. But <laughs> when you get told that you can't have children, it is disheartening. Yeah. But I suppose you wasn't thinking about it, was there? Then with you being on them injections to lower your blood sugar for your diabetes to get us on fertility, we thought we would have to accomplish that before we could have a family. Yeah. But so it was. I suppose that took our mind off everything, didn't it? Yeah. So if you ever get told that you can't have children. Don't listen to them because it is possible. Yeah, I suppose it's like when the doctors told me I'd never walk again or I was going to die when I was run over. Yeah. I proved them wrong both occasions then and we proved the doctors wrong together again. Yep. And my heart goes out to everyone who suffers with fertility problems because obviously we thought we would yeah. Have to go down the route of like IVF and stuff, but just walk this way, Katie, because there's no water. Oh, you okay? It's amazing, isn't it? These old stone walls aren't held together with cement or anything that, that are stacked on top of each other and it's stay up here for hundreds of years. Yeah. Obviously it needs repairing there, but the rest of it stays up for years, doesn't it? So I hope our little videos inspire you to not give up guys and keep going. I've always kept going, even when people told me I can't do something, I still do it. Makes me more determined to do it. Which is why I became a PT, I suppose, to help people reach their goals in life. And we've ticked off our next goal. We're starting a family. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> Just waddling along like your favourite creature, a penguin. Your favourite animal. Yeah. Everything fits into place now, doesn't it? How you've been over the last few months. Yeah, moody. Sleeping all the time, throwing up all the time. Yeah. Don't to say I'm half through. Halfway through this pregnancy. And we've only got just under four, four just under four months left. I yeah. I think I've bossed it the half the first half. Yeah, you've smashed it. <laughs> you've smashed it, babe. Yeah, look, there's another public footpath sign there, look. If you ever see these symbols while you're out walking, it means you have put it's a public right of way. 
There you go, look. So we're going to come through this gate and we're going to shut it behind us. If I can open it. Oh, there we go. You just come through and I'll shut it. Thank you very much. If I can shut it. Say no, hello to your friends. Very pooey. Yeah. <laughs> Probably the back of my leggings are filthy. No, no, they're alright. As you know, guys, I walk with a leg splint to keep my back straight, and I've got some new straps it recently, and. They don't come undone as I'm walking now, which is really good. Oh, you okay, Katie? Yeah. Oh, Just come on done and we just reattach that. Oh, well, I've done that. There we go. It's a bit high now, that's better. Oh, that's too high now. Go through this way. Pretty sure we can. Is there one way to find out? That's about it. Afternoon. Yeah, there's a public footpath sign here, look. I'm just trying to shut the gate again. Let's cut it. You okay, Katie? Yeah. Which way is it now? It must be. Hi, guys. Which way is the walk? Just stay away, yeah. You can go that way if you want. Okay. Thank you. All right, thank you. Oh, over there, look. If you get lost, just ask. <laughs> you okay? I 
Old farmhouse, sheep farmers. Yeah. And I think, that, yeah, the water's here a lot. The other way, but we couldn't go that way because they were loading sheep. After you. Just be careful when you go down the other side. So we can go. Thank you. We can go that way up the hills. That way back the way we came. Or this way into the village. I think we'll go this way. Oh, that's a bit too long now, isn't it? That's a bit of height, isn't it? You okay? Yeah, I don't think you'll be able to manage up the hills today, do you? No. Tomorrow we've been a Tomorrow we've been told where our waterfall is about four miles from where we are. You go to the car park and it's about a mile walk. So we're gonna give that a go tomorrow and record it for you guys. If Katie's up to it tomorrow that is. You look like a farmer. What with your hat on? Yeah. That is now called the, the daddy hat. It's not an old man's hat, it's called the daddy hat. You'll sleep well tonight, Katie. Definitely. Wow. That's if I can get, get comfy in bed. We'll have to order you one of them pillars, won't we? Yeah. For when we get back on Sunday. Today's Friday, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Another little stream, look. Bridge. Oh, there's another farm over there, look. Another farm there. Hello, which way we go? Hmm. I'm not sure either. There's a sign up there, look, so let's keep going this way. I think it's this way. Well, we drive over the stream, don't we, in the village, so 
and the stream's going that way oh. and there's a public there's a sign up there look You okay? Yeah. This time you're right in front. I know, it must change, doesn't it? <laughs> Just want to make sure we're going the right way. That's the public by the way sign there, so I think we're going the right way. Yeah, and then here's the village. So that's the end of the walk, guys. So we're going to walk back, guys, and we'll catch up with you tomorrow. See ya. Bye. Oh, yeah. Don't forget to like and share this video. And if there's a channel, hit that little subscribe button. And also turn on your post notifications as you'll get notified when we upload the next video. Bye again. Bye for the second time.